We have a warning tonight about just how easily your money can be taken in the blink of an eye. This is, is no joke here. A Middle Tennessee mom says all the money she had to pay for food for her family, it was gone in an instant. Like that. An investigative reporter, Lindsey Bramson, found out she's part of a growing crime trend targeting those already in the need of assistance. Oh, yeah, they took everything. Everything Bobby Ivory had to help pay for food that month was gone. And they took me for everything I had on my card. Each month, she counts on financial help from the state to pay for essentials like food for her family. It's what experts say make her and everyone receiving help from the government a growing target for hackers. This is the ultimate form of debit card because it's replenished by the government. WSMB4 Investigates contacted the Tennessee Department of Human Services about this. A spokeswoman tells me they are aware of a sudden increase in EBT card fraud due to skimming, but there's very little they can do to help victims like Ivory. Just in the last month alone, the department says it's received nearly 300 calls from people who say the same thing happened to them. They haven't did anything about it. They said they're going to go into details and find out what's going on, but um, I haven't heard from anybody. Fraud experts say whether it's skimming or having your account information compromised, getting the money back is nearly impossible. If they do a, a you know halfway decent job, of, of just, you know, covering their tracks. It's almost untraceable and unrecoverable. Ivory says she had no choice but to figure something else out until more money was put into her account. I have other people that depend on me that I have to take care of. So when they take it from me, they take it from my family too. Ivory has since received a new card, but wishes the state could do more. They told us they can't reimburse victims for money that was stolen. So the biggest tip I can give you, don't give out your pin anytime to anyone. And we have more tips on how to prevent something like this from happening to you right now on our website. Just go to WSMV.com. For WSMV4 Investigates, I'm Lindsey Bramson.